Hello guys, and before before you go into the description and look, because this is going to be a redirect, I want to say, if you want to skip me just rambling, you can go to 2 minutes. Because the movie starts around, I think, 2.05 or something. But, here's something I want to, because I was talking about tickets. I thought the movie would be released this Friday here in Sweden, as well as, you know, because it gets released in the rest of the world. But not in Sweden. In Sweden it gets released on the 20th of October. And we... Uh, my mom is the one who take, takes care of buying the tickets. So that's why I said, oh, I, because I thought I well, we already had tickets. But I was incorrect. They haven't even started selling them. So that's wrong. And we plan on going on Sunday the 22nd. So that's it. That mistakes is out. And also, all I want to say, because is I've already seen the uh, movie. Um, and I've already done the re reaction. This is after. And now, let me talk about a bit about spoilers of how I felt about the movie. I felt it was a great movie. Easily, I like a 7 out of 9. Easy 7 out of 9. Because I went in that this movie would be shit. That's what I thought. This movie would be awful. And I was incorrect. It's a great movie. And yeah. I really hope this movie does okay. Pretty good. Because then we might get another movie. I really thought they did a good job. Um... I mean, they could have booted out the Sia character. The Sia character were fucking awful. It was horrendous. The, muse, the song was shit. So they could have saved a lot of money, I'm sure. I'm just not having her. The movie would have probably been a little bit better if she wasn't there. So that's one thing. But she, it, it's kind of like maybe five minutes of the whole movie has anything to do with that character. So that's fine. Um, doesn't diminish that much. And then that little comic relief character was also sh horrendous. But same thing. Not a lot of the movie was focused or had him destroying it. So, and the rest I thought was pretty good. Tempest, I was like, oh god, Tempest is going to be like this fucking... I thought Tempest would be shit. The first time I saw her, it was... I was like, oh god, no. Because in the movie, when I saw her the first time, I was like, oh god, she has a broken horn, she had a scar. Uh, she's gonna be shit, isn't she? But no, she was good. I really liked Tempest. And I also liked the Hippogriff Queen. Because she was like, fuck you. I need to protect my own subjects. My, sub my own subject comes first. And, well, just fuck you, Twilight. Because Twilight lied to her. So she's like, I can't trust you, you're not good. Because in her mind, uh, the main six, or the main five, were actually on board with what Twilight wanted, you know, just distract them while she tries to steal the jewel. Or the pearl. So, yeah, that was good. Fuck, this move was great. So good. Apollo will put up a, like, a no-spoiler thumbnail for this. Or no spoilers. Because I don't want to spoil people. Because this movie was really great. I really hope. I haven't looked at what kind of merchandise will come out of this from this movie. But I hope it's good. Because I mean these two will not be in the boxes for long. I'm going to take them out of boxes. Put them up there. Because this is the Ayase Aragaki shelf. Which is getting full. Yeah, so I probably will put the ponies maybe on that shelf. Or down here, we'll see. Because down here, I have a lot of, you know, things that are easy to grab. And also, this girl right here takes a lot of, a lot of space. And, yeah. We'll see, I have to redecorate. Um, yeah, I'll probably get, if, depending on how good they look, I might get a Tempest one. Because I really liked her. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Hasbro, don't fuck it up. Don't make the merchandise shit like you did for the first Equestria Girls. The, mini the minis are good. 
Um, and I do plan on getting some minis sooner or later. But the original dolls that you tried to sell with that movie were awful. Even though Equestria Girls 1 is pretty good. Equestria Girls 1, out of the movies, I'm not taking in the specials. Out of the movies, the best one is Rainbow Rocks. And now I'm talking scientifically. You know. Rainbow Rocks is the best. And then the first movie. Then... Um, Ever Free... The Ever Free one, and then Friendship Games. Friendship Games were, was a bad movie. Um, Ever Free was okay. Equestria Girls were good, and Rainbow Rocks was great. One of my favorite movies of all time. So there you go. 